What's up you guys, it's Ness, and today I just wanted to talk to you guys about shooting in a small space. Now when you're shooting in a small space, you have to understand that you're not going to be able to set up everything that you would normally set up the way you would set it up. So what you have to do is find the right equipment that will get you the same results that you would get if you were in a studio. Now sometimes that may or may not work, because a picture won't always tell you the exact size of the space. So you won't really know until you like get there and set everything up. But when you are doing location shoots in small spaces, I highly recommend that you take your time, you have fun with it, and you just try to test yourself as a photographer to uh, find different lighting situations and scenarios that'll you know, give you a different look to your work or a different vibe. And you never know what you can come up with. As you can see, I was using a 7200 for this shoot. My back was right against the wall and I wasn't too far away from the model, but the 7200 is always my go-to when I'm working with beauty. But the key thing for me is to make sure I'm comfortable in my space and make sure I'm able to move around without tripping over everything, as well as my model. But you gotta understand, the more you guys have fun and the more you guys utilize the space that you have, you guys will settle in and then you guys will get great results. In this particular shoot, we actually did three looks, but I only showed two in this video. I only used two lights, one being a seven foot parabolic umbrella, silver with no sock. And I also used the light with a seven inch reflector or the 30 degree grid, just to give some extra fill on the side of the face. Now with the first look, I actually brought a cream color backdrop from my home studio. And for the second look, her walls were actually blue. So we opted to do something with the blue look with the blue walls and it actually worked out. But this is what I mean by trying out different things as a photographer to explore your creativity and see what you come up with. And I loved how it came out. But that's about it. I hope you guys liked the video. Remember to comment, like, and subscribe. And I really wanted to make this video to show you guys that you don't need a big expensive space to make some great quality work. So with that being said, keep finessing those shots. You gotta be right to feel yourself and a whole lot of gang shit. Till next time, finesse out.